Hello Scorpio, welcome to another love reading. What can you expect in love? Keep in mind that this reading is general, so it will not resonate with every Scorpio watching. All right, so let's jump right in. Spirit, angels, guides. What guidance do you have for Scorpio regarding love? What can Scorpio expect in love? What can Scorpio expect? We have by the book and building blocks. So together these energies are obviously building something with building blocks, building a foundation, taking your time to build something. Um, and by the book is like doing things right. So this is like a very good foundation here with both of these energies. By the book is very similar to like the Hierophant. Um, you're following the rules, following whatever regulations, traditions there already are in place. Um, Okay, some of you this has to do with work, like maybe you work with someone that you're interested in or um, you met at work, something like that. Um, let's see what else we have. What else can you tell us for Scorpio? What can Scorpio expect in the love? What can Scorpio expect? Spirit? Scorpio expect in love. Breathe in, meditation, healing, rest, take time to meditate and relax your mind and body. What else? What else? Sweet dreams and second chances. Okay, so this could be your goal or what you desire or someone that is interested in you this is what they're hoping for i feel someone wants a second chance with you we'll see what we get with the tarot maybe this time they want to do things right get some insight please for scorpio what can we expect in love we're also going to take a look at who you might be dealing with okay what can Scorpio expect, Spirit? What can Scorpio expect? Page of Wands, King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. Wow, the Ace of Cups. Could be dealing with an air sign. There's the world at the bottom of the deck. So some sort of new beginning in love with the Ace of Cups. Someone here is taking an initiative towards you with the Page of Wands. We'll have to see what it's about. It could be a message from someone. You know, someone asking you out. The Page of Wands tends to take that little risk. You know, they just kind of want to just put themselves out there. Sorry, can I get some clarity for Scorpio? What do we need to know about these energies for Scorpio? Tell me about the Page of Wands. Why is the Page of Wands here? Why is the Page of Wands here? The Four of Pentacles. Why is the Page of Wands here? The Devil, Capricorn energy. Hmm. Tell me about the Page of Wands. I'm getting like really intense energy. Here and I'm trying to figure out. Yep, six of wands. We just sort. Whoever this is, there's the high priestess. Maybe you're not quite like aware of their thoughts about you or their feelings about you. Someone's really into you, Scorpio. They want to talk. They want success. I mean, I, I literally am picturing someone watching you. As creepy as that sounds, with the page of swords here too. It's like they want to make their move. They want to talk to you. Whoever this is, it's like you have a hold on them. Very intense. Could be a Capricorn. But the High Priestess here in this breathing card, it could be that someone in the Four of Pentacles, you know, this holding back energy. It could be that somebody has been um, holding on to this idea, this attraction that they have towards you. 
the devil is a little concerning being here, but I'm not going to jump to conclusions. So I'll just clarify the rest. Tell me about the king of swords for Scorpio. Why is the king of swords here? The hermit, Virgo energy. Here's that quiet energy again. Tell me about the king of swords. Queen of Cups. I feel like this is somebody that um, has already been thinking about you. Whoever this is, you've been on their mind. Oh my god, that's a lot. You've been on their mind. Wow, the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune keeps coming out for a lot of people. And the Ace of Pentacles with the world. Are you freaking kidding me right now? If this is what someone wants to talk to you about, um, talk about amazing energy. And again, I just get this energy of someone that's like really into you. Queen of Cups, Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles of the world. You know, thinking about you a lot with the Hermit. Could be an air sign, Capricorn energy is there. Um, this could even be somebody that you work with that has just had this eye on you or been interested in you and hasn't really come forward. Because the Hermit, the Four of Pentacles, the High Priestess that showed up, they tend to be quiet energies. Um reserved energies tell me about the ace of cups tell me about the ace of cups please keep grabbing more than one the five of wands and the hangman okay tell me about the ace of wands i mean why did i say ace of wands ace of cups tell me about the ace of cups please why is the Ace of Cups here? Three of Wands. So this is a waiting energy. Page of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Maybe there was some sort of conflict here with the Five of Wands. Or someone feels like they have to compete for you. Compete for your attention. I feel like this is someone that has been waiting to um, communicate. Yeah, Knight of Swords, Page of Cups. So they've been holding back this whole time. Whoever this is. Tell me more about this situation, this connection. What does Scorpio need to know, Spirit? What do we need to know? Oh! Okay. What oh, these flipped? Privileged lady. Message of concern. The lovers. Bad health. You might have a history with this person, but that privileged lady, that's that energy I've been getting of someone like watching you. There's the message energy. Definitely a message coming in from this person. This this person, you, you and them might have already some sort of um, history because I feel like this person wants a new beginning, a second chance. And, and that could be because you've already been together in the past or perhaps you had a chance to be together and this person didn't take it. Despite the fact that there seems to be a strong connection here with the lovers, Ace of Cups. Tell me more about this situation here for Scorpio. Very soon. Okay, so something is happening quickly. Let's look at this person. Let's look at their energy. What do we need to know about this person coming towards Scorpio? I just wanted to say Aries there. Spirit, what do we need to know? What do we need to know about this person coming towards Scorpio? What do we need to know? about this person coming towards Scorpio. Wow, the world again. What do we need to know about this Seven of Wands? What do we need to know about this person coming towards Scorpio? What do we need to know about this, the Chariot? Okay, Cancer energy there. The Hierophant, Taurus energy at the bottom of the deck. I definitely feel this person wants to move forward, come towards you with the chariot, have a new beginning. 
but I think there's a bit of a resistance energy here. Maybe this is similar to that five of wands that showed up. It's like there's um, someone that might be resisting this or needs courage to face whatever obstacle exists. Because seven of wands is about standing firm against anything that's like in your way. Can you get some clarity, please? Tell me about the world. What do we need to know about this world energy? The Nine of Pentacles. That's like that privileged lady. Someone admiring you. You having a lot to offer. Ten of Cups. Tell me about the world. Yeah, this person wants it all. That's why Sweet Dreams is here. Your dreams are becoming reality. I think this is their ultimate dream. Their goal is to have a Ten of Cups with you. The Six of Pentacles is here as well. So fixing something, bringing something back into balance. Tell me about the Seven of Wands. Why is the Seven of Wands here? Why is the Seven of Wands here? The Three of Swords. Maybe you've been hurt in the past. Maybe someone needs to overcome heartache, disappointment, to have courage. What's happening here? Wow, the Tower. So maybe you and this person have a history with the tower. Well, if there was a tower, there's eight of wands. Hmm. You know, there's a couple ways I can interpret this with the eight of wands and the tower, because the tower is an unexpected, shocking event. So it could be some sort of unexpected communication that comes in with the eight of wands and the tower, right? This is surprising, right? It could even be painful with the Three of Swords, or perhaps there was a painful tower that happened between you and this person. And now there's resistance because of that. Someone's blocked here with the Two of Swords, guarded. This could be you. This could be the person you're dealing with. I think this is more you, Scorpio. I feel like this person, um, they think they're concerned about the state of things, bad health message of concern. Maybe there was a separation between you due to this tower. Let me know if that's the case in the comments because I feel like this person, they have not let you go. They're holding on to you in some way. I feel that energy of someone like really into you. Tell me about the chariot. Why is the chariot here? The Empress. Wow. Similar to that Nine of Pentacles energy. Why is the chariot here? Page of Pentacles. Yes, this person's coming forward. And they're going to come forward with a small offer. Page of Wands, Page of Pentacles. The Ace of Pentacles also showed up. Yeah, Six of Wands. They want to have success here with you because they love you. King of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Or they have feelings for you. Now, I don't know what happened between you and this person. Obviously, you will know that more than me. But I feel like this person wants a second chance after a difficult tower. What else do we need to know about this person coming towards Scorpio? What else do we need to know? My heart belongs to you. I can't let you go and I'm working on myself. Okay. Probably why building blocks is here too. But more than anything, I feel like they want to prove to you, this person, if they're coming to you for a second chance, uh, it's not to do the same thing that they've always done, or it's 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 to have uh, some sort of improvement, right? Let's let's work on building a stronger foundation. Let's work on building a stronger relationship. What else do we need to know? about this person Scorpio is, has, or will be dealing with. Okay. I love you unconditionally. A lot of feelings here from this person. What else do we need to know? My life is not as together as it seems. Maybe that's why they're working on themselves. Whoever this is, I feel like there was already some sort of ending, like I said, um, and they're coming to you to tell you or at least admit um, that they're still interested, that they still want this. 
Of course, it's going to be up to you if you decide to accept the, um, this offer, but I'm definitely thinking about an offer. Page of Pentacles. Where is it? Right here. Page of Pentacles with this Eight of Wands. Tell me about this Page of Pentacles and the Eight of Wands. Why is the Page of Pentacles with the Eight of Wands here, Spirit? First Scorpio. Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here with the Page of Pentacles? Wow, and the Tower again. With the King of Cups at the bottom of the deck, you could be dealing with another water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I think this person, um, this uh, offer will surprise you. This message or off or you know proposal with the Page of Pentacles, um, it will surprise you. There's there's gonna be something shocking about it or unexpected, um, or this is happening after a tower. But the fact that this happened, yeah, there's the Page of Cups. I feel it's a message, a message of you know how they feel that they still have feelings for you that they're they still love you they still care about you etc etc i do feel like that's for some reason you're you're probably not expecting it because i feel that tower happened so it's almost like someone coming to you with a second chance it's like really you still want to try yes that's that's what i see here and it's going to be very soon according to this oracle here things are moving quickly especially with that chariot and the eight of wands as well so that's what i have for you scorpio hopefully you enjoyed this reading if you did uh please hit that like button before you leave subscribe if you haven't already i would love to have you and that way you can kind of keep up with all the new readings that come out